Ms. Wilson. Good morning. I'm Holly Wilson. I'm a sixth grade teacher at Wrigler K-8 School. And I'm here today to talk about how the Right Brain Initiative has had a direct impact on my students. Wrigler is in Northeast Portland. We serve about 600 students, and our students come from a variety of cultural, language, and economic backgrounds. 85% of our students are on the free and reduced lunch program, and 36% are English language learners. For many of the students at Wrigler, their access to the arts begins and ends at school. Luckily, my students and I have had the opportunity to learn from a variety of artists through the Right Brain Initiative. As a teacher, one of my greatest challenges is to make the academic content comprehensible to all of my learners, and um, this can be extremely difficult, especially given the demographics of the school. Our, art, our artist residencies worked with me and other teachers to take the content standards and integrate them seamlessly into a variety of mediums. Dance became astronomy, theater became history, and drumming became geography and an unexpected lesson on teamwork and cooperation. This collaboration has pushed me to become more innovative with my own teaching practice. In sixth grade, students are already solidifying their beliefs about the type of student that they are and the role that school plays in their lives. And the Right Brain Initiative gives students the opportunities to say, I get it, I'm good at this, I can do it. And this year I was struggling to increase student participation in class discuss discussions, especially among my female students and English language learners. Uh, after our brief residency with the Oregon Children's Theater's Loud and Clear program, all students in my classroom are very eager to share their ideas. <laughs> we constantly refer back to the speaking skills that we learned, and I even have students asking permission to stand up to address their peers at the front of the room. Um, <laughs> this has given the sixth graders in the Cully neighborhood of Northeast Portland a voice, and this is priceless. When I told my students that I would be here today, they were full of suggestions. <laughs> and also let me know their personal feelings about the artist residencies. So I have the great privilege of sharing their voices with you today. My students say that the artist residencies make school much more fun and interesting. The programs made them want to come to school. The artists inspired them and gave them an opportunity to interact with the content rather than just listening to it. With the drumming circle, they learned that if they didn't listen and stay in rhythm with one another, they sounded bad. <laughs> but if they all worked together, they made music. Wrigler has been enriched through these programs, and I believe that every child deserves access to the right brain residencies. My students and I thank you for supporting RAC, for listening, and for your time. Thank you. Very <laughs>